we just want to know exactly how good an elephant's uh, sense of smell is and uh, see if we can use them to do something else down the line. Just a piece of filter paper with uh, TNT on it, a small amount, and, uh, and then other scents. So we'll put in petrol or diesel and, you know, mangoes and other things, coffee. And just the elephant has to ignore all the other scent and uh, just only indicate to us when he smells TNT. It's very, very important that, uh, that you know people understand that we're not there to take elephant and put them into a landmine field. The idea is to bring the landmine field to the elephant. So if we can take air samples or something from there, then we can use it. Uh, we're doing some research on vocal vocalization and communication, and uh, we're trying to understand how they can communicate their distances that they uh, claim to uh, communicate. And we want to find out if we can use some of the communications to try and help keep elephants out of areas with humans in. Another thing with the scenting ability is to see if, uh, if uh, males and females can identify their kin from their scent and therefore not mate with each other um, and see if that has an implication in all these islands of elephant uh, across Africa. You know, how do they find water underground? How do they find electric cables underground? How are they able to push over electric fences? You know, that sort of stuff. There's a hell of a lot to learn from them, uh, even in their scenting ability. Can we, can we get an elephant to possibly find a disease or do something. It's only the tip 